This is a heartfulness meditation on gratitude. The aim of this meditation is to develop a more appreciative and grateful attitude toward all that's good in our lives. We'll begin this meditation by finding our seat. So finding a sitting position where you can sit upright. And you can be comfortable and relaxed for the next 10 minutes. Your hands can be resting on your thighs or in your lap. Feeling a sense of balance, especially at the point where your sitting bones touch the earth, the floor, cushion, the chair. Balance from the left to right sides, from the front to back. and also balanced vertically, upward to downward. Feeling a sense of alignment with the force of gravity, being held by the core of your body. Noticing this aliveness and ability in sitting upward. At the same time, feeling the relaxation and ease of sinking toward the earth. Finding a posture where we're both relaxed and alert. And then letting your attention settle downward into the body. Sinking down from the head to the upper body down to the waist, to the legs, all the way down to the feet. Feeling your tension settle into the body and through the body. Relaxing around any areas of tension. A key to developing gratitude is simply to remember what's good. We're deeply programmed to overlook and forget these things. It's probably because we're constantly striving to make things better or working to avoid what's difficult and painful. While that's understandable, when we become so committed to changing things, we can forget how fortunate we already are. So let's practice remembering what's good. One way to do this is to reflect on some of the opportunities we have that perhaps many others lack. Just by the fact that you're able to do this meditation means you're among the small minority of human beings that have access to virtual reality. How fortunate we are to have access to new immersive mediums of entertainment and exploration. How amazing. What other modern conveniences do you have access to that you're grateful for? What are the things you get to use, take advantage of, that are part of the infrastructure that you live in. Now consider your close relationships, your family, friends, even your pet companions if you have them. 
Who in your life do you have strong and healthy relationships with? Who comes to mind as your inner circle, your closest relationships? Who do you feel like you can count on in times of difficulty? Who can count on you in times of difficulty? Bring these people to mind, your closest connections. And just sense into the natural gratitude that you have for them. The natural and easy sense of appreciation that's already there. These people who have been there for you, who you can count on, who listen to you in times of difficulty, who are simply present with you because they care. They maybe offer something to support you. But really, we're connected with them so deeply because of the simple presence that we offer each other. Giving into the gratitude for the people who are really present with us. And even for the pets that are present with us that are there for us at the end of a hard day, not wanting anything in return, just loving. How easy it is to feel thankful for these people, these animals. And consider what gratitude they likely have for you. See if you can put yourself in their perspectives, in their shoes for a moment. What kind of appreciation do they feel when they consider you and how you've been there for them? Feel the gratitude that's radiating toward you. And see if you can feel appreciative for that. Now we're going to open it up to feel appreciation for whatever's easiest in our lives. Perhaps it's the time you spend in nature, walking the beach, or spending time outside under the trees. Perhaps there's gratitude for a capacity that you have, a skill, or some measure of good health and vitality that you're able to enjoy. Perhaps you're grateful for certain people who are taking a stand for the things you value most and who are leading by example. Whatever is most natural for you to feel appreciation for, bring it to mind and sense into the boundless heart of gratitude that remembers the good. What are you grateful for? those opportunities that are good in our lives. Sometimes 
times we overlook them, but they're always there. They would allow us to flourish and grow as human beings. This is a meditation written and recorded by Meditate Io. I'm Vincent Horn. If you found this valuable, you can find more resources for training in the digital age at meditate.io. Thank mm-hmm. you.